One, may I have your attention, please? We hope you have enjoyed your fabulous dinner so far. We will now start what we are waiting for, the top 100 on building ceremony. Before this takes place, may I invite the top 100 manager, Bart Hageman, for a few words, please. Well, thank you. Thank you very much. Um, I'm Bart. Uh, thank you, Beatrice, for the, for the introduction. Uh, thank you all for coming here in this great environment. Um, I would like to first start with a warm, uh, warm welcome for all uh, people who are here for their uh, destinations and to, come, uh, to collect their top 100 selected destination certificates, uh, but also very much the people who uh, are joining in via the live stream all over the world. Uh, so I'm very proud that we can give this exposure to them. Um, we are about to unveil the ninth edition of the Top 100 competition. The Top 100 Stories has become, over the years, a very important program of green destinations. It's an opportunity for destinations that are just starting their journey towards sustainability recognition, to get training on the basics of sustainability performance and storytelling, and to learn about the green destination standards. So really, the Top 100 is the gateway of, uh, of green destinations. Um, and for the destinations that are already awarded or certified, it's a great still opportunity to gain recognition for their initiatives and increase their global promotion and visibility. Um, so there's well, a lot to tell about the green destinations and I know I only met a few people here from the destinations uh, which I had a lot of contact with via email. Um, I'm really happy that you're here. I'm not going to talk longer because I'm sure you really want to get to the moment for the well, the, uh, the certificates who are going to be handed out. So, Beatrice, the floor is yours and enjoy the moment. Thank you very much. Thank you, Bart. Well, without any further ado, we will now unveil the 200 and 2023 Top 100 Destinations. And we will do this by story category. The first category will be Destination Management, an important category with, for example, visitor management strategies, disaster recovery solutions, and stakeholder management.
congratulations to all of the destinations in this category that have been selected to this year's list. Thank you for your inspiration. I could hereby invite all representatives of all these destinations to join Albert Salman, Mr. Salman in the stage, to the group photo, please. Congratulations again to these great examples of destination management solutions. Let's not wait any longer and unveil the second category, thriving communities, highlighting the best practices in community-based tourism, community development involving local communities, producers and stakeholders in the tourism supply chain. Please watch out for the video and come near the stage for all the winners.
destinations with thriving communities and showing how to involve the local community in tourism development. The third category will be a combination of the categories nature and scenery and culture and tradition, ranging for how tourism can contribute to biodiversity conservation, animal welfare, and ecosystem regeneration to heritage protection. Congratulations to all of the destinations in this category that have been selected to this year's list. I would like to invite all the representatives of all these destinations that are present with us today to collect their certificate and join us on stage. Move a little forward, please. 
One step forward. Yeah. Right. Thank you. Congratulations. Yes. destinations of the last two categories. Are you ready? Environment and climate and business and marketing. Two categories that are pretty much overlap from combating climate crisis through mitigation to innovative ways to communicate about sustainability, both to reduce the environmental footprint of tourism. Ladies and gentlemen, the video for this category.
wish we could give the time to each of them to come and present the initiatives and projects for sustainable tourism development. But you can find all the global practice stories on the Green Destination website in the top 100 program page. I highly encourage you all to have a look. All this can make excellent replicable models to other destination managers, tour operators, tourism consultants, but also to visitors in general who will definitely find some inspiration for the next travels. Good evening, everyone. And please, friends, enjoy the dessert and while networking. Please keep doing the, wood, the well done job that you have been doing. I hope that from this room we all live full of hope that we can make a change. Thank you. Enjoy the dessert. <laughs>